Today I'm going to be reviewing the touch screen purse. It's me, Christina Louise. Be sure to head over to Facebook and Instagram and give me a follow at the Feisty Fit Yogi. Now today I'm back with a brand new TV stuff review. Be sure to like this video, click the little bell in the corner. That way you're gonna get a notification each time we post a new video and you're never going to miss a thing moving forward. Today I'm going to be reviewing the touch screen purse. So you can kind of see here on the back, it's just a little clear part. Your phone's gonna go here inside the front. You can open it up with this little clasp. We've got shoulder strap, and then I'm not sure if you can see it, but there is a couple little like credit card holders, little, little slots right there for you to put your credit card or your ID in there. And then in the back, there's an entirely separate pocket. You see there's the two right there that the phone goes in. So this is what we're going to be reviewing today, the touch screen purse. So it just came in a little white box in this little clear bag. Took it out, here it is. Back part, you can see that screen, or that clear part, I guess I should say. And then the front, just this little clasp right here, push that. It's just gonna open right up. And then inside, and you'll notice that there's two pockets, one in the front, and then also one here in the back, which is where your phone goes. And then inside, you do have the shoulder strap. And then just to give you a better look at the two pockets, so your stuff can go here, and then your phone can go here in the back. I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera, but there are one, two, there's three little credit card. There we go, right there on the back, three little credit card slots so you can put your cards, you can put your ID, and then you still have a little bit of a purse to put your chapstick, put your key, put your mask. <laughs> and then in the back, you can put your phone. Obviously, I'm using my phone to record, so I've stolen my daughter's phone, and it's just going to go right here in the back, and she does have the Samsung Galaxy Note 9, so it's a pretty big phone, just for size comparison here. It's gonna go right in there. Oh, I should have probably unlocked it. I had to ask for her password. So, let me do that, just so I can show you that you can still touch and navigate through. Oh, she was watching a video. Okay, so putting it back in there. I guess I could have used it <laughs> through this to unlock it. Hello, that's why we have this feature. So swiping from one screen to the next, you can see it's still registering my touch there. And then if I wanted to just kind of go back home, go into Google, her phone's set up all weird. Oh, it takes her directly to Spotify. But as you can see, you can click and navigate and still use the phone there through that screen. And then if I wanted to lock it, that's gonna be kind of difficult. Those buttons are on the side. There we go, locked. And then to take a look at that shoulder strap. I mean, it's a pretty long shoulder strap and of course it's adjustable. I can see this being really good for like thrifting and garage selling and I say those specifically because that's just what I got home from doing. It's Friday here, Friday morning, so hit up some garage sales and this would be so perfect rather than having my huge big clunky purse and have to take it in and out of the car every time. It's hard enough to remember that dang mask. <laughs> so I am just clipping on the shoulder strap. I didn't know a good way to hold it up and do that at the same time. But here you go. And then, like I said, it is adjustable so you can make it longer or shorter. You do have this little hole like in the plastic on the front to just help you kind of get on that screen and then just unlocking it. 
back there to the home screen. So yeah, nice little purse. So if you are out and you need to check something on your phone, you get a text message, you get a call, you're out thrifting, you wanna see how much you could resell something for, you can just come on your phone, you don't even have to take it out, get it all dirty and germy and gunky. You can go ahead, look up whatever you need to look up, lock it and obviously I need to make it shorter. It's like right, right here, <laughs> but there you go. And that is the touch screen purse. And just to show you what it will look like on, there you go. And I don't even really have to take it off, especially if the strap was a little bit longer. I could just keep it like this, do whatever I need to do, and put it right back down. I'm hands-free to shop, do whatever I need to do. And again, I can just pull this up, unlock my phone through the plastic screen, do whatever I need to do without getting my phone all dirty and gross. So after playing with the touchscreen purse, I would give it four out of five stars. And here's why my only complaint, well, I guess I have two. My only complaints are, as you saw, it was a little hard to like push the buttons on the side of your phone as far as locking it or even the volume buttons that you'll have on the other side. I'm not quite sure how they're gonna get around that, but I wish that could change and be a little bit easier. And I don't know about y'all, but I have a lot of things on my keychain. For my key, I have pepper spray, um, I have my keys, my little clicker for my car, the clicker for the gate. So it's a big keychain and it's not going to fit in this little purse. And I hate taking off little rings off that keychain. Like it is what it is, I wanna keep it that way. So maybe if the purse could be just a little bit bigger, and if they could figure out a more user-friendly way to click those side buttons on your phone. But other than that, I think it is great for on the go, especially if you're thrifting or yard sailing, or if you're just going out hitting a lot of stores, running a lot of errands. I know Black Friday is coming up. I love the fact that you can still use your phone, navigate through all the different screens and all your different web pages by keeping it here safe in the plastic so you don't have to sanitize your phone. We're already wearing masks, we're already sanitizing our hands and everything else we touch. Let's just keep our phones in here so we're not transporting all those gunky, nasty germs all over. So four out of five stars for the touch screen purse. Again, be sure to like this video, click the little bell in the corner. That way you're going to get a notification each time we post a new video and you'll never miss a thing. Until next time, be sure to follow me on both Facebook and Instagram at the Feisty Fit Yogi. And until then, bye y'all.